Welcome back. Well, three games have been selected and they are all football events from different parts of Europe. In the English Premier League, there's the game between Pep Guardiola's Manchester City and Frank Lampard's Chelsea at the Etihad Stadium. In the Italia Serie A, it's a, the experts have chosen the game between Torino and uh, Inter Milan. And finally, in the Swiss Super League, we have the game between Sion and uh, Young Boys. And first up is the game between Manchester City and Chelsea, and I'll go straight to expert Aziz to handle that one for us. We know that Manchester City are um, lagging behind the tabletop as uh, talking about uh, Liverpool, but let's see if that game against uh, Chelsea will be one that they can actually win and uh, reduce the points between themselves and uh, Liverpool. Expert Aziz? Uh, of course, if, if you look at uh, the major leagues uh, uh, this weekend, this is actually the biggest game uh, mm -hmm. in the major leagues this weekend. Uh, Chelsea playing away to Manchester City. Mm -hmm. Of course, Manchester City, they know fully well that they are currently nine points behind the league leaders, Liverpool. Liverpool. They know that there is no um, uh, uh, there is no way they can uh, uh, afford to draw points, any more points mm -hmm. uh, until the end of the season if they still have uh, hopes of winning uh, their third Premier League title in a row. And they are, the game against Chelsea is one they would uh, really want to take uh, very, very seriously because Chelsea are Currently, told as I speak to you, Manchester City fought one point behind Chelsea. Uh, these are two direct rivals talking about uh, uh, the top four, but Manchester City, we all know, are not competing to be in the top four. They, they are a team that is built to win titles, and a game against Chelsea is one game they will see as a chance to put one of their direct rivals uh, for, for the title uh, away. Uh, if you look at Chelsea this season, they have won their last five away games on the trot, sure. scoring 18 goals and considering nine. Manchester City have been scoring for fun at home. The only game they have, they have failed to score on home soil this season was actually a 2 new reverse uh, against Wolverhampton Wanderers when Adam Atraos scored two late goals uh, to condemn Manchester City uh, to a 2-0 deficit, uh, defeat at home. Uh, of course, against Chelsea, it will be a difficult game entirely. Chelsea are brimming in confidence. Their scoring goals are plenty. Mm -hmm. They are winning games. Uh, they are scoring goals for fun. And of course, uh, you look at Manchester City, they have some players uh, uh, injured. Of course, some of these players may be coming back this weekend. But then against Chelsea, I know that uh, this game is actually a game they cannot afford to draw points. Sure. And that is why we believe that uh, since both teams are teams that are not known for their defensive uh, uh, abilities, they know how to score goals, and they are actually very, very shaky at the back. That is why we believe that this goal, uh, this game actually will see over 2.5 goals in this, and we expect both of these teams to get on the score sheets. Mm. All right, I'm so looking at uh, the selections right there and analysis from expert Aziz. Let's go straight to the market options that we've chosen for you for this game between Chelsea playing a way to Manchester City at the Etihad Stadium. And for both teams to score as the BTS option, it goes at 1.55. And uh, the over 0 0.5 halftime means that a goal will be scored in the first half of that encounter, and it goes at 1.23 odds. And over 2.5 will be going at 1.45, meaning that three goals or more will be scored in this game. And I'm also tempted to add um, Manchester City to get a straight victory in this one. But it's, it's dicey because we've seen over time that Manchester City have not been able to um, defend. In, the, in, the, in this, if you look at this picture in recent years, Manchester City definitely have the upper hand. Last season, we saw City recording a 6 0 mauling of Chelsea at mm -hmm. this same ground at the Etihad Stadium. Of course, Chelsea were the first thing to, to uh, out the unbeaten run last mm -hmm. year with a 2 0 win at Stamford Bridge. But then at home at the Etihad Stadium, Manchester City. Surely not to win, and I'm not looking past them to get the win against Chelsea. 